So today's question is from Pam in California, and she is asking questions about how she can start selling her products online. Okay, great. Uh, thank you, Pam. So before you get started, there's a couple of things to consider, and the first of which is, um, do you have your own website? Because if you do, there are actually plenty of e-commerce tools that can integrate with your website, uh, things like Shopify, uh, BigCommerce, or WooCommerce, for example. And if you don't have a website, you'll definitely want to create one. But first, you're going to have to get a domain. So we can actually register for one at constantcontact.com. Mm -hmm. Um, next, you're going to want to decide uh, when and where you, or sorry, how and where you want to host your, your online store. And this is actually where you have some options. Yep. So one is to choose a website builder that has the ability to create and host your online store, um, like our website builder. This will actually allow you to set up and manage your storefront right through the integrated tool. Yep. And uh, another option is to go with an e-commerce platform. And this is a platform that will actually help you with your marketing, uh, payments, your checkout process, shipping, all of that type of stuff. And so this is usually done for a monthly fee. And finally, you can build and set up your store right through your site. This might actually take a little bit longer to do, but it's worth the customer experience if you do it. Yeah, and, and no matter which path you decide to go down with your e-commerce strategy, it's really important that you think about securing your site so that your customers know that their information is not going to be exposed to hackers and things like that. So that helps put them at ease. So thanks for the question, Pam.